take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The toxin level in the snake plant is very low to pose a threat to your pet unless it consumes a lot of it, which is still unlikely. So, the snake plant will not kill your cat but it will be affected to the extent that you may want to take him or her to the veterinarian. Let's help you make your mark. Snake plant but the plants are also poisonous if ingested. Large doses can cause nausea and vomiting, and the poison found in the plant has a numbing effect that can cause the tongue and throat to swell. The plants are more toxic to dogs and cats, which can suffer from nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. 31 July 2017. Make your mark, take our lead. The mother-in-law and RSQUO's tongue plant is a common house plant that is toxic to many domestic animals, including dogs and cats. The mother-in-law and RSQUO's tongue plant contains saponins, which cause gastrointestinal discomfort. Take our lead. 10 cat safe plants that are also hard to kill. Ponytail palm. Despite what their name suggests, ponytail palms are actually succulents. Parlor palm. Parlor palms, or bamboo palms, are not only beautiful and cat friendly, they're also natural air purifiers. Spider plant. Red prayer plant. Polka dot plant. Rattlesnake plant. Let's help you make your mark. Common houseplants like English ivy, aloe vera and snake plants are excellent at removing air pollutants indoors. But beware, these same plants can make you, your children and your pets sick, or even kill you, if ingested. 13 April 2016. Let's help you make your mark. Saponins are the toxic component in the mother-in-law's tongue plant. The rupture of red blood cells comes from severe gastrointestinal-related activity of the toxin. Saponins have a foaming action which leads to the gastrointestinal upset. They also disrupt normal cell pathways causing cell death. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.